So we're out at the uh, Tran West Hoxton Depot of Transit Systems. We've come out to make a presentation of a novelty check signed by the directors to the company of Transit Systems in excess of $1.1 million in recognition of all the money, taxpayers' money, that this company's pocketed over the last two and a half years that belongs as a contribution of wage growth. People here feel they are demoralised and underpaid. If you look in the broad spectrum, this company is just using the drivers to make profits. The changeover of drivers on the whole is maybe 50% every year, maybe. Companies that get money from the government should pass it on when they're obliged to to their workers. What's happened here is also a very good reason why workers should be in unions, because it's the unions that will stand up for them and try and recover this money. Hi, Brian. Come out the front with all the company. And members would like to see the money that you've been pocketing over the last two and a half years. It's way in excess of a million dollars because it's been stalling on for the last two years. Drivers here haven't received a pay increase since 1st of July 2014. Shame. You think that's okay? Every other company in the industry passed on those government wage increases. In recognition, in recognition, here's the money to yourselves so that we all know what you've done so it's transparent. Um, our CEO. Well, that, if we contact the CEO, he'll what? I'm more than happy to set up a meeting if you want to set it up. I'm more than happy to come down and meet with you on the CEO. That would be fantastic. <laughs> the great thing today is we finally got a commitment from Graham Richards that we will now meet with the CEO sometime in the near future, where I'm hoping will be very early next week. I would request, or I would say, I would suggest that we all get behind the drivers here, make this company buy up the drivers' money, which is due long time ago, two years ago.